In this video, we're going to take a look at how to submit work in modeling and animation using a screen capture. This is good especially for assignments where I need to see what a settings and things like that you've done. So let's pick out some uh, happy little modifiers here on the pyramid. So I'm going to pick one out here. This is a bend. And then we'll use these to adjust. Here's a nice little FFD. So I could go in, change my settings to it. And then let's pick out uh, one more, maybe a happy little turbo smooth. But I can pick any of them out I like. And the most important thing is to be sure to check the assignment and see exactly what modifiers or number of lights or whatever I'm looking for on this particular screen capture. This helps me out because I don't have to worry about things being downloaded from the internet and just submitted. I'll know it's your actual work. So I'm going to use Snagit, which is a screen capture program. It does videos like you're seeing here. And it also does screen captures. And it lets you specific, specific parts of the screen and you activate it by hitting the print screen. And then it gives you this nice little interface here that you can select what you want to capture. In this case, I want to be sure to capture the object I modified, which was the pyramid that now kind of looks like a clam. And I want to be sure the settings over to the right are selected. Okay, and this is the Snagit Edit menu. So what I'm going to do here, and if you're using another type of capture program, you could kind of do the same thing. I'm going to save this, and I'm going to drop it out on the desktop, and name it here. And it, JPEG or PNG works well. I found with my uh, learning management system, Canvas, that JPEGs work really well, and PNGs do as well. So I uh, save that as either one. Okay, now I'm going to go into my Canvas LMS and submit the video. I'm actually showing a resubmit here because it's important to know that in modeling and animation you can resubmit work for extra points and things like that. So I'm going to choose the file. I'm going to navigate back to the desktop, find the file I just saved, open it, submit. And then I'm all done. Now let's take a look at what I see when I go to grade this. You go into it in the quick greeter here. And I look over and I make sure you've got the parameters and things you need. And then I put in a grade. I can also leave comments and things if you need to resubmit if you've left things out. And I hope you've enjoyed the video.